Hi there, this is David and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Heroes Treasure Cold Steel 3. Since last time I did a little bit of grinding because I just had to buy the Blitz Coat and the Excel Boots for everyone with plus 7 speed and plus 5% evasion. Like, you really can't miss these two items. You've got to get them, especially on higher difficulty levels. Even if they have less defense and magic defense than other pieces of armor, the evasion and speed is completely worth it, so I bought this for everyone, so everyone at least has 5% evasion. Kurt's up there, though, with 55% evasion. Yeah, I'm loving it right now. It's really, really nice. Um, everybody else is floating around 20-25%, except for these two who aren't in my party anyway, with 5 and 10% evasion. They'll come into my party eventually, but again, I'm looking at link level, and right now, they actually have a decent link level. It's shockingly still Kurt and uh, Yuna, who haven't really bonded with Reen yet. Anyway, let's continue exploring Ordis. This is the last district that we have to go into. Oh, North Street. Not really a district, but eh, whatever. Oh, okay. Oh, a glass workshop. That sounds kind of cool. Yeah. It actually does remind me a lot of Crossbell. You've only been away for- well, no, you've been away for quite some time, actually, because you went to St. Uh, Saint Astraea first, too. Oh, okay. Sure! I would love for you to go say hi. Maybe we'll actually call you by your real name. Maybe we'll learn something about you. Maybe you won't be so mysterious. Really, future husband? You are ridiculous. <laughs> oh, she seems pretty damn serious to me. Okay, so let's look around before we go to her house. Yeah. She really does get around, doesn't she? Oh. Oh, wow. I guess so. Oh, well, that's at least one good thing. What do you mean there's something about him? Huh. Really? He owes him. Hmm. How unusual. Let's go to look at this guy's face. Oh, he's... Eh, nothing special. But you do want to buy his ground sausage. Yeah, we'll need that for later. Anyway, let's keep on going through here and head to the uh, Sea Breeze Inn as well. Because just like the other inn, there is a recipe that we can grab here. The colorful bouillonese, I guess. I don't know. Bullabase? Beats me. I have no idea. Anyway, we got it. Let's go. Where am I off to next? Oh, there's another little shop here. It smells nice. Ortis is also known for its abundance of flowers. Okay, now we can talk to her. Glycine? Kind of an odd name. Like glycerin or something. Okay. But the real reason why I'm here is for some rose perfume for Sharon and some watermelon seeds for Sandy. Let's go ahead and send off that gift to Sharon before I forget. I am known to forget a lot of things. I'm sure she'll love it. Ooh! Level 3 bonding! Max bonding with Sharon! Hey! Awesome! Always nice to have that. Uh, what else do we have here? We have a private home. Oh! There's Musée's house, but first, we have this horrible factory, Strauss. Let's head on in there. There's a quest that we can, uh, start up in here. Hey there. Yeah. Word really does get around. Oh. 
Oh, wow. That's true, and he's rotting in prison as well. So he has a point. Pretty much. Like, it was all a result of one man who had way too much power and was way too crazy. <laughs> Good for him. Yeah, the commoners really are uh, coming up in this town, I've gotta say. Oh, okay, so he's the famous glassmaker. I thought this was an Orban shop. Okay, uh, yeah, we can help you out. That's fine. What do you want us to do? Oh, what kind of decorations is your glass shop gonna make? A glass apple? That's a different game. Okay, so you're gonna be using seashells for decorations. Jade shells. Oh, okay. Oh. I would imagine on a beach. Wow. This guy, I know, he's so angry with us. Sure. Okay, so we should go to the beach on the Oros Coastal Road. Okay, so that's it for that quest. Let's see if uh, this guy has anything else to sell. Oh, hey there. Oh, really? The golden emblem? I think that that's a gift from his highness. Yeah, I guess so. Wow. <laughs> Don't blow things out of proportion. Nice little pun there. Okay. Do you sell any glass at all? I'm actually really curious about this. Ooh, another gift. Trilogy Hearts. And, okay, this is another watch you can grab. But again, I am really low on Mira right now. I feel like I should sell something just to grab it. I don't know, I'll sell a couple of these. Um, is that enough? How much does this thing cost? Oh, okay, perfect. Just enough. Okay, so anyway, we got another gift there. Let's go ahead and send that one off as well. Lots of gifts here. It's not dual hearts, it's trilogy hearts. Did any of you ever play dual hearts? I did. I really didn't like it. Sorry to say. It's a 3D action RPG, and that really should be enough said as far as I'm concerned. I'm just not good at them at all, and they're terrible as far as I'm concerned. If it's going to be an action RPG, it should be 2D. This is the end of my story. Okay. Oh, great. Um, well, if they're related to her, it probably is. Hmm. We'll do our best, but her family's... I mean, if they're anything like her, they're just probably really strange. Or maybe they just know how Muse is. Oh, it's uh, her maid. I am Setsuna? No, she is Setsuna. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. I guess she wrote her a letter or called her on the phone or something. Oh, okay. To the very- how would she know about the very hour? No kidding. You would know the day, but not the very hour. Oh, these must be her grandparents. Oh, they seem like nice enough people. Yeah, how you guys doing? I wonder if they're gonna call her by her real name. 
You would think that they would. Or they could just not call her anything. Oh, wait, no! They are... Why aren't they calling her her real name? What is going on here? who she is. Driving me crazy. And my whole theory about her being related to Duke Cayenne is completely off, too. That sucks. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, I guess so. Long Lie? Is that the, is that the inn from Crossbell? What is that? I think it is. Oh, well, I just got the old dragon in the entire time. Oh, okay. Really? 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 Man, he seems to know everything. Yeah, how did you know that we were looking for the Jaeger Corps? Oh, okay. So he has no information. He's like... One of the most powerful people here, with no information. That's just lovely. So he was Duke Cayenne's advisor. So he should have some information. Something to help us. <laughs> yeah. I wonder where he gets that from. sure it will, as well as Ouroboros and the Jaegers. Oh. Well, you could still be retired and just go and just hang out and see what they're all talking about, and then report back to us. Actually, tell us something. That'd be nice. I guess so. Yeah. Um, she's okay, I guess. Yeah. She has a particular reputation, and she definitely earns it. Oh. Oh. That's kind of cool. Um, sure. Really? She's their hero? Huh. Oh. Yeah, but she worked for the losing side. Like, if she didn't work for them, the war wouldn't have dragged on as long as it did. So, I don't really know if I'd call her a hero, but okay. Okay. So we really didn't learn anything about her. We didn't even learn her real name yet. Like, come on. I thought we'd finally get to the bottom of her after this, but I guess not. But who were your parents? Hmm. Oh, you haven't really been here since you were nine? Huh. Yeah, what's going on with all that? Um, you're the only delinquent, Ash. Hate to break it to you. 
But what were your reasons? Elise and Alphen were talking about that too, but we don't actually know why you left there. What were your reasons? Oh, that kind of makes sense that she would know Aurelia since, you know, they grew up around the same. Well, yeah, this is their hometown and everything. I wasn't able to help you at all. Neither was I. I wish there was something I could have done. <laughs> Your concern is more than enough. I couldn't keep going to St. Astraya either way. But why? Why couldn't she keep going to St. Astraya? Did she have an affair with one of the teachers or something? Like, what is going on with her? And it seemed like it was beyond their control. Like, they tried to help her, but they couldn't do anything about it. Like, what exactly happened? She's still just a mystery. Okay. And get those shells, too. They're all in the same area. Oh, they're doing fine. You just spoke to them. Ooh! So now Musei and Ash both have access to their S-Crafts. Sweet! Sorry for that cut right there. I basically just had to go around and talk to everybody for the NPC dialogue video. Because whenever you head over to this beach road, and after you just uh, defeat the monster, it's going to move on to a different time of day, and then NPC dialogue will change. So I just had to talk to people and whatnot. Huh, a sparkly thing down on the beach. I wonder what that could be. Yeah, at least the game makes it easy for us. I kind of remember we had to find something like that in Zero or Azure. On the beach in uh, Michelin Wonderland, but it was kind of invisible and it was hard to do. Oh. I would imagine so. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so let's see what we got going on here. Um, oh, here's some new monsters. Let's go after them. They're in disarray. Little, like, I don't know, floating fish things? Something like that. Yeah. They have, like, weirdo fish googly eyes, though. Yeah. It's down. Too slow. You were a big I help, Kurt. That's my line. Oh, we actually got some fishing bait from them. That's really quite nice. I've got to say, it's always good to get some fishing bait. I can always use more of that. Oh, here's an guy. opening. Oh, just one. How simple. There we go. Everyone okay? Okay. There, I will have to go grab that treasure Look, though. There's a beach! Come on! I wanna go! Yuna, you're getting too worked up. Visiting the beach is always nice though. Ooh, got a freeze level two and. Ha! Ha! Ah, ha! Ah, ha! My gauge isn't high Enemy enough. Found. Begins Whoa! Depression. Holy crap! Lots of guys! Um. I really don't feel like dealing with all these guys. I'm just going to S-Craft them, like, screw this. Can I get all of them with this S-Craft? Oh, perfect. Be I right. can. I'm up! Oh, wow. That didn't kill them? Seriously? Um, yeah. Form. Gale. Now! Too slow! It's my turn! Oh man, these guys are like just ugh. They're just not going down. Um, let's see. We'll use a jump you can't blast. escape. Fire! My okay, turn. Got rid of them, and now it's just this one guy left. Yeah. So let's just use regular physical attacks on him. Maybe we'll actually get to see what he does. It's down. too slow. This is it. Or not. You were a big help, Kurt. I believe that's my line. Ooh, whoa, plus 16 CP, and it increases automatically, and it goes up to 200 whenever your HP is low? Holy right, crap! Yeah, I did it! I must train even more. 
stats updated. <laughs> <Not Nice. laughs> I grew a little. Ooh. Oh, wow. Nice. You know, for the boss fight that we have coming up, I do want to throw them in the party because they both got S-Crafts, and I do want to uh, show off those S-Crafts. Let's see. So there's the beach. There's the quest. Um, yeah, let's head on down there. Whoa. Whoa. dive straight into the water like that. Getting soaked with seawater seems like it could be problematic. <laughs> I have to admit, that does look fun. All this sand and not a single sun-kissed lady in sight? What a waste. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. And, uh, isn't there like a huge monster down here on this beach, Yuna? Yeah. I really don't want it to, like, pop out from the water right behind you and eat you alive or anything. Can't have that. Oh, but what do we have here? Hey, we got the Jade Shell. Sweet. Oh, it's too puny. Oh, that's true. Yeah, he has a point. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, we have nothing but time, so let's keep on looking around and uh, see what we can't find. Oh, here's another shiny! Yikes! Uh-oh. Everyone it. ready? Okay, what do we got? Oh! 100 mirror coin. Oh. That's true. Not a whole lot of money, but it's something, I guess. And what'd you find, Kurt? Hey, got a large jade shell. Oh, but it's still not flawless. Yeah, it's a bit better, but still not good enough. piece of glass like a piece of junk yeah no kidding it's glass Yuna glass if it's like beach glass that's really like pretty and all that and weathered that'd be nice oh a brilliant jade shell hey hey that should be the one that we want right oh it's not very large and we'll hold on to it for now. Let's see if there's anything yeah. else that is around here. Let's turn on high speed as well, just so I can cover this beach a little bit more efficiently. Ooh, wow, lots yeah. of efficient beach. I yeah. easy. Okay, took care of them. I still don't see any yeah. more shinies around here. Oh, there's that huge monster. I don't... Err, I didn't really want to deal with the monster right now. I wanted to deal with the beach stuff. Oh well, that's fine. I still have plenty of time to find all this junk on the beach. Yeah, we are. Oh. Calmly and carefully. Screw calmly and it's carefully. A powerful enemy. Exercise caution. Here's what we're going to do, actually. We're going to swap some people in. Let's swap you in got Jose. This. <laughs> Leave it to me! And let's check out her new S-Craft. I'll cast a spell on you! <laughs> so pretty! Brilliant shot! I may have gone a little too far. It's my oh, wow. turn! Um... Let's use a raging let's fire go. order. Raging fire formation. It's my turn. And let's actually swap in Ash now. Good so luck. You can see I'm up. 
his new S craft. Now, let's dance! I ain't done with you yet! Yeah! Helio Raid! <laughs> Sweet dreams. Damn! My turn. That was uh, some rough stuff right there. So let's look and see what we got going on here. Weak to Earth. Um, oh, burn status and poison status. Confused charm. Huh. Okay. Yeah, so a lot of stuff Ch going on here that we can uh, inflict yeah. on this guy. And you know what? Let's see. Um, anything else decent? Though? Oh, minus Brianna, defense. Activate. Yes, Fire. please. There. Keep it up. Oh, lovely. Very well. I don't like the sound of that. Can I do anything to impede? Uh, I can't. There. My turn. Perfect. Uh, Altina. Let's go again for... Reanac, activate. Fire. Hoping for minus defense. Now. Keep it up! I'll finish it. Woohoo! We got him! Shall I pour you some tea? Extra sugar, please. Yeah, I did it! I must train even... Stats updated. No, it didn't. Oh, really? Wonder what happened. Oh, yeah, a civil war will do that, won't it? I guess she was remembering her parents who died. That's sad okay but first before we do that let's go fishing oh I spy some fish okay at this fishing spot the one thing that you do want to try to catch is a blue marlin ooh an action two quarts awesome that's not half bad Anyway, we're still looking for that seashell around here, or the jade, whatever it's called, the jade shell, whatever. So we're still on the hunt for that. Don't see anything yet, but I'm keeping my eyes peeled. Oh, I do see something shiny up there behind that rock, but it also looks like there is a path over here. Oh, there is. Hidden secret passage. Well, what do we have here? Nice little hideaway. Passion leggings? What are those? Oh, eh, okay, it's a halfway decent accessory. There's a fishing spot here, but you can't catch any new fish here that you wouldn't have already caught. So, don't worry about it. And let's head on back to that shiny spot that we saw earlier. Through these little rocks here. I love hidden passages like that. That's my favorite. Oh, well, what you got there, Ash? Oh, something! Ooh, a flawless jade shell! Nice, that's exactly what we wanted. Really? Oh. Wow, a hundred years, man! No kidding. Okay, so we got to turn that back into the factory, but huh, looks like there is a uh, an event up here. But before we see that event and head on back to Ordis, uh, we'll be doing that next time on Let's Play The Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 3. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a good day.